Bye, honey. I'm gonna miss you. Don't go. Where are you going? Mexico. Okay, Poppy, we just showered, we brushed our teeth, and now we're gonna make breakfast, okay? And we have to clean up all of this mess. Well, it's not a whole lot, but yeah. We have a lot to do, Papash, okay? You want some breakfast? Do you miss Daddy already? I miss Daddy. We miss you, Daddy. Let's clean up, let's make breakfast, and uh, you guys are just gonna tag along with us uh, throughout this weekend. Uh, my husband, Desi, is on a short-term mission trip uh, in Mexico, and he will be back tomorrow night. Yeah, look at my son. Look at my son. Hijo, ¿qué estás haciendo ahí arriba, hijo? Huh? What are you doing out there, Papa? What are you doing, Papa? Okay, let's get off from there. Little Desi. Desi. I know, Papi. I know you're hungry. I'm gonna make you some quick eggs. I'm gonna make you an egg. Okay. And I'm gonna make some Kodiak cakes, flapjack mix right here so banana first while his food gets a little bit on the cooler side thank you lord for our meal thank you for mommy and daddy yummy for my tummy mm. Mm. now i'm just gonna wait for this to cool down and I'm gonna feed my baby Dazzy. And I'm gonna make myself, um, I'm gonna make myself a Herbalife shake because I need to get to it. Like, we're missing daddy, right, little Des? We're missing daddy? Yeah, we're missing daddy. We love you, honey. Just gave him his egg and also his little flapjacks. We'll see how much he eats from that. Mmm. Thank you, mommy. Wait, I have to clean this area here because it's driving me nuts. So apparently my husband is rubbing off on me because he is like a total frantic clean freak. Like literally. Comment down below if you have the same issue with your husband. Like, comment down below if you have the same issue with your husband. Or why, you know, where one is like super, like extra clean and the other one is just like chill. Just like, let it be, it's gonna be clean when it gets cleaned and don't let life pass you by. Um, cleaning, you know, you find yourself cleaning. Well, that's how I think. Not kidding. I'm kidding. I do like for it to be clean, but I'm not crazy, crazy like my husband. Look at him, guys. You like it, Papa? You ate all your food? You like it? You want more egg? Yeah? Okay. Let's give him more egg. Let's give him more egg. It's 2 30. A little Desi is asleep. So I'm going to put my makeup on really quick. Uh, YouTube family, life with Jesse, so we made it, we're in the one I how do we know we made it? I'm uh, looking at these delicious tacos, tacos, the Tijuana, and ahí is la cocinero ahí atrás, tacos. Hey guys. Okay, so little Desi is still asleep and I managed to put some makeup on. 
<laughs> we have arrived to the U Charm Surprise Ranch in Ensenada, Mexico. Looks like it's a real ranch. Is that a cow? Is that two cows? Oh, Lord Jesus, it's a, it's a family of cows. Wow. The Utah for Ranch in Mexico, is, they're very lucky. I think they're eating well. Oh, that one, huh? Yeah. Could this be our dinner? Is this our carne asada? So it's official. We are here at the ranch. This is Flaco, aka dinner. You can get a lot of bacon from this cow here. I'm sure my baby little Desi would be happy as he loves to eat bacon like his mommy. I can bring some home for you if you would like. You two friends and family, this is where you give this video a thumbs up. Thumbs up for the pig, Flaco. Support, Flaco. This makes you appreciate the small things. This is a homemade outdoor laundry mat. So this is where the people here in Mexico wash their clothes. They bring them to these things and they wash them inside these little holes here. Yep, how long will it take? Uh, and then after they're done washing them, they would dry their clothes. And drying their clothes will not be that of a dryer but hanging them outside to dry wow makes you appreciate rolling washing machine and dryers huh yep much you think about Guys, so my husband called me earlier, um, but I didn't hear the phone. It's 3 o'clock already, and uh, my um, friend and her kids are coming over. We're just going to have a little get-together. Her husband also went to the um, weekend mission trip in Mexico. Como, como, como? ¿A dónde vas, Brida? ¿A dónde vas tú, little Desi? What are, you, what are you doing, buddy? What are you doing, Ian? Are you ready for the throwdown? Mira, mira, acá está la dieta. No! Yo que acabo de comer nopales. <laughs> Ellos comieron pizza. Y yo comí nopales. No te los acabaste, amiga. ¿Qué pasó ahí? <laughs> <laughs> voy a ganar, okay? Yeah, Así. Yo voy a ganar. Even with a broken pinky toe, I'm still gonna win you guys. Aunque tenga un broken dedo, un dedo quebrado, les voy a ganar. ¿Dónde está hoy? Ajá. <laughs> Hey, hey, hey. Okay. 
Y con un dedo quebrado, ¿ok? Eso ya es, me estás este, sobornando y chantajeando. Ah, ok. Ah, ok. Ah. infection I'm gonna say yesterday where I noticed that he started producing like gunk um, on his left eye and uh, I was cleaning it and then I was also putting like uh, chamomile tea bags on it and then right now at 1 a.m. he threw up everywhere inside his crib so I had to take him a shower bye so here I am listening to the true MVPs, the mamas out there, the Mexican mamas, the Hispana mamas. They said to um, put warm chamomile tea um, on his tea, on his tea, on his eyes. And um, <clears throat> I'm going to get a clean towel, like a little towelette to um, and get it damp and put it on his eye. Hey, little Dizzy, where you at? Where you at, little Dizzy? Gordo? Hey! Papa! 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 How do you like it, honey? Oh, it's nice. I got a lot of footage, and I'm here hanging out with the pigs. Hey guys, so Desi just called me right now to see how we're doing. And basically I told him that, um, that um, I'm not gonna release him or let him go to on another missions trip until little Desi retires from his profession. So that is something, sometime in 55 years from now. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Um, so I just finished cleaning the house. Well, I still have to um, vacuum, but I can't do that until little Desi wakes up. his um, eye with the little towel and uh, I'm just washing his lunch pills here and that's it okay so it's cleaned I just wiped it all down um, with disinfectant spray and also um, well I applied Lysol spray and then wiped it down with Lysol wipes so I also opened the 
window for fresh air to come in. And little Desi is still asleep. So glad to have Desi back. Say hi, buddy. Guys, it's already 12.09 Monday morning. My little one is not feeling well. I'm taking him to the, for a doctor's visit with his pediatrician tomorrow in the morning. Just glad that Daddy Desi is here to love on him as well. And Daz, Daddy Desi is happy to be back. Mm. I was gone for two days and I missed my wife and my baby. Mm. And I was thinking of my wife. I didn't come back empty handed. I went to a ranch with a whole bunch of cows and brought her fresh cheese. Does it smell? No. Do you want to see it? Yeah. Are you sure? We might have to go to the kitchen and open it up. It's actually queso de. Oaxaca, so it's cheese from Oaxaca, Mexico. Oh, okay. Yes. So. Is it like, for like quesadilla style? Yes, it's like string cheese. It's good. Let's check it out. Okay. So there's a long story to this cheese. I had to go up this mountain, and I went to this ranch. There was about fifty cows. I had to talk to this ranch guy, okay. and he was a real cowboy. Yeah, he was uh, protecting his cheese and his cows. And, wow, it was an adventure. And how did you? Oh. Yep. Should I open it all up? Yeah. Oh yeah, this is a string cheese. So this is it, guys. But did you have it in a cooler when you brought it? Yes. So I did this for my wife. Actually, you could have got in trouble. This here is what you call it. <gasps> Desi! Yes, I love her so much for a kilo of guess <laughs> Are you serious? You could have got in trouble? Could have got in trouble, but the Lord was with me. Let me tell you what happened. The car next to us. Mm -hmm. uh, Raided it, and so there was probably like 50 cops on this one car, and they made them get out with their hands uh, on the top of their head, and they made a big ordeal. And all the cars that surrounded it, they may get out and like push back, and we were stuck there. And uh, the driver was just thinking, I hope they don't have a bomb, you know, because we'll be dead. But I don't know what they had, but they got caught. So maybe they had queso. Uh, I doubt it, but who knows? They might have brought the ranch guy himself. <laughs> but this. I'll show you guys. This is uh, this is the ranch I had to go to to get this gasol. Mm. And they, they, these are more of the cows. And this guy here, he was supplied with gasol. Just look at his refrigerator. Look at oh, that. Wow. He had gasol there. Guess so for years. Yes. Maybe he's on a Look keto diet. So if you guys are interested, leave a comment and I can tell you where we're at and it's an of this cowboy is and you can go buy your own cheese. But for this cheese, my wife will eat it all. I'm pretty sure of this. I got a thick quesadillas and you know, she's on a diet and I know probably one slice of this is about 300 <coughs> calories, but let's see let's see what this uh let's see what happens with this cheese why don't you taste it for your youtube uh i'll audience. taste it tomorrow because little desi's crying okay. but you look very handsome honey thank glad you glad to have you back bye, bye.